From your local election headquarters, it is now two weeks until Election Day, and Dr. Jill Biden visited Lackawanna County today to try to mobilize voters and talk about her husband Joe Biden's plans if he's elected. Eyewitness News reporter Caroline Forback was there as the former second lady took the stage in front of more than 200 cars for her drive-in rally at the parking lot at PNC Field. Scranton, how are you feeling? Are you ready to vote? <laughs> Hours from the Pennsylvania voter registration deadline, Dr. Jill Biden urged the people of Lackawanna County to get out and vote and emphasize the importance of early voting. The former educator spoke directly to teachers. And while this has been such a difficult time for my colleagues, I have never been more proud than to be an educator than right now. The former second lady talked about Joe Biden's plans to reopen schools safely. She said her husband would guarantee quality public education for all children, an important cause for Scranton school district teachers like Jennifer Telesco Loftus. She addressed the crowd before Biden. As a mom, I worry about my own children attending the underfunded and unsafe schools that so many of us teach in. Jill Biden hit on other key policies like protecting unions, creating well-paying jobs and affordable health care. It means protecting pre-existing conditions and making prescription drugs affordable for everyone. Another local teacher, Courtney Degnan, says she and her daughter have pre-existing kidney conditions and she's concerned about their health care. She believes Dr. Biden is in her corner. Dr. Biden is just backing us up. She's backing our unions up. She's backing our children and families up. Joe cares about other people. This president that we have cares about himself. Luzerne County Republican Chairman Justin Barron says the event is probably a Hail Mary for the Biden campaign. They know they're losing northeastern Pennsylvania. Uh, they're all going Republican and they're, this, they're waiting to the last minute. Will you stand with Joe Biden and Kamala Harris? Reporting in Music, Caroline Forback, Eyewitness News.